Good evening. I'm very excited to be here tonight. I can't see any of you. But um, the bus journey on the way here, always a lot of fun. And, um, but uh, on the way here, I was talking to my mate. He's got a turban. I don't know if you know him. He was stood on one leg. He's called Balan Balancy. And um, so we were discussing the yawn, because he's got a mate called Snoo, snoozing, obviously, who, who started to yawn on the bus. And in theory, once I start to yawn, everyone will start to yawn. And the whole bus will apparently fill with yawning people. But if that was actually the case, we'd all have died out years ago, because there'd be no oxygen left on the planet. <laughs> but luckily, we've got Lester Potholes. <laughs> Up and road. Perfect. You're just about to fall asleep. You're about to do the best yo-yo manoeuvre on earth. And then, and then suddenly, <laughs> big pothole. And where there aren't any potholes, obviously, we put speed ramps in. <laughs> Leicester City Council, wasting your time and money. Brilliant. So I was testing all this out on the local population, and one of them actually said to me, I've had a lobotomy, and which is <laughs> quite familiar because t uh, two years ago I had a lobotomy curing epilepsy and it's been the best thing ever. But to have that shouted out by someone, um, I've had a lobotomy and it was still funnier than you. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough then. So uh, the last manoeuvre that I've learned, everybody tends to go back to your yo-yo when they're 30. One of the most obvious manoeuvres everybody seems to learn when they're 30 is called the rebound manoeuvre, which obviously string theory does bind life and all sorts of things to how yo-yos work. But basically, once it's gone, it'll never come back. That's me. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs>